that Green Pop is known for their work in our environment and the awareness they've created around our beautiful nature. With us this morning, Zoe Gold, and welcome back, Toy De Lazy, to tell us more. Ladies, hello. Hello. Hi. Sitting there like besties on the couch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So we, so, so we know that Green Pop is synonymous with environmental awareness, but where did it all start? So it's a really interesting story because Green Pop, I think, really epitomizes the idea of the potential of a seed, mm -hmm. like something really small turning into something big. Yeah. It started five years ago with Jeremy Loops, who we all know now, um, Misha Teasdale and Lauren O'Donnell. Yeah. Uh, they got together some of their friends and they all wanted to compensate for their carbon footprint. Mm -hmm. So they decided to plant a thousand trees in nice. September 2010. They managed to do that. They all went back to their day jobs and then everybody was like, what? No, you have to keep going. Mm -hmm. um, so so they actually founded Green Pop then and since then we've planted 50,000 trees wow. and we're in our fifth year and it's just amazing. Wow. Yeah. Now of course there's a big event, Cool as Folk, tell us more. Yes, so Cool as Folk is a party for the planet. Uh, it's an annual fundraiser that we run. Uh, we have one in Cape Town and one in Joburg this year. Joburg is happening tonight um, and you can catch amazing Toy De Lazy there as well as Jeremy Loops, uh, our very own Jeremy Loops. Um, he's going to be headlining as well uh, with some other amazing acts including Majosi, uh, Flint oh, Meets Spark. Oh, yeah. It's going to be amazing. Yes, um, we have some little secret events kind of lined up. Uh, we have a skate cycle walk to the event so people can actually get their green through their own power. Uh, yeah, so it's going to be a pretty epic evening. That's awesome. Toya, why does this mean so much to you? Why did you decide to partner with this event? Well, I was telling Zoe um, that when I was in Varsity, I was part of a project called the Greening UKZN. I was part of UKZN and basically we're just like trying to make reses more environmentally friendly and we're doing events similar to this one and end up planting trees. So um, I'm quite green. I, I love the green. I'm going to say it. Um, and yeah, this event is just one of those. Like Fantastic. it's peace, loves people are just like enjoying the vibe and yeah, I'm just going to do what I do in that environment. Wonderful. So how can people still get involved? So you can find all the details on our website. Um, it's greenpop.org and and uh, tickets are still available on Quicket. You can find them all there. It's at Baseline in Joburg tonight, and it'll be at Sideshow next Saturday in Cape Town. Wonderful. Thank you so much, ladies. Thank you for joining us and for being here. Toya, can't wait to see you. I won't be there, but oh. the next one. Yeah. Because flying from lovely Cape Town you, to Joburg. <laughs> always <laughs> lovely singing. Like, yeah. we love our city. We love that you are always involved. Thank you so much, ladies, for everything Thank that you, you are doing. Thank and like you. Zoe said, if you would like to get involved, all you have to do is go to www.greenpop.org to find out how you can support Green Pop and also all of the amazing initiatives that they have. Well, it's time for us to head back into the kitchen with Ewan.